All right, so today we are going to be doing uh, number operations with decimals. So today in our lesson, we will cover two parts and I will be covering the first part. So uh, what we're gonna be doing is overestimating and underestimating with decimals. So let's say that some bananas cost uh, $1.29 and we wanna buy 18 of these. So an underestimate uh, way to calculate the total amount of money that you have to spend is by rounding down to the nearest whole number. So this is an underestimate, which is why we're rounding down to the nearest whole number. So for $1.29, that would be $1. And for 18, it would just be 18 because 18 is already a whole number. And if we multiply these two numbers together, uh, $1 and 18, we get, we get 18. So $18 for the total amount of money that you have to spend would be the underestimate. Now there's also another way to find the overestimate. So let's just use the same example that we did, except now we're gonna be rounding up to the nearest total number. So for $1.29, rounding up to the uh, nearest whole number would bring us to $2 and $18 would stay the same, well not $18, 18 bananas would stay the same because it's already a whole number. So we'd be doing two times 18, which is 36. So 36 would be the overestimate. So this is uh, how you're gonna be rounding to find the underestimate and overestimate. All right, and now uh, do you want to explain part two? Uh, yeah, there we go. Uh, I don't think your audio is working right now. So another form of operations using decimals is multiplication. So let's say I have the number 0 0.5 and I wanna multiply that number by 0 0.4. So the way you would do that, the easiest way is to just take away the decimal points first. So that would leave me with five, that would leave me with five times four, which equals 20. So now that we've taken away the decimals, we need to add them back. So as you can see, um, there are two decimal spots that are moving to the left here. One from here for 0 0.4 and one from here for 0 0.5. So we need to add two, we need to add a decimal two places to the left of 20. So that would become 0 0.20 or 0 0.20. Um, and that's pretty much how you multiply decimals. Uh, you just take away the decimals at first and then you can add them back. And that's the simplest way to do it. Um, I think that's pretty much it. All right. Uh, those are the two parts for uh, number operations with decimals.